Plantma X, a completely new machine for mechanical forestry planting. Development of Plantma X began in the late summer of 2018 through a new company, Plantma AB. The machine has a center-mounted MidiFlex disc scarifier, which through its design allows for a short rear frame that enhances the maneuverability of the machine. The seedling is fed into the planting tip by free fall. This is gentle on the small seedling and its root system. Control systems and hydraulics are all latest technology. Besides reading the pressure in the planting tip to determine ground conditions, rock or wet ground, before releasing a plant, the machine can also source information from the scarifier. Ground conditions vary from area to area, and often even within a given area. Preferred species and size of plant vary. When planting, a number of factors depend on ground conditions. How deep? Where? Plant in the trench made by the disc, in the hinge, or in the berm? Designing Plantma X, our focus has been versatility, to develop a machine that can easily change from the scarifier making a shallow ditch and planting in that ditch, to the scarifier going deeper and making a berm of exposed mineral soil and planting in the berm. In the cab of the base machine, from where the scarifier is controlled, as well as in the cab of the planting unit, control buttons can change these settings. The planting arms are adjustable sideways, so the distance between the left and the right planting tip can vary from 1760 to 2740 millimeters. Following our initial forest trials to verify different parameters, Plantma X has been operating for Svea Skog, a major forestry company. Results have exceeded our expectations. Under continuous progress on good ground, the cycle time is less than three seconds per arm. Optimal working speed is between 1.8 and 2 kilometers an hour. It's possible to go faster, but unless ground conditions are optimal, planting results may be affected. A natural next step is to automate the feeding of seedlings in the machine. This would allow the operator monitoring the planting, who currently feeds the seedlings manually, to work on the ground behind the machine. With remote control, he can monitor the planting arms and can also correct any planting that has gone wrong. Another option would be to use a camera and AI to identify the best microsite for planting the seedlings, but this is a few years down the road. We strongly believe that systems for fully mechanized forestry regeneration are the future, and we're convinced that PlantMax is part of that future. The planting machine is one part of the puzzle, the actual tool to plant the seedlings. How to use the tool, planning the site, calculating working hours, the logistics of transport of seedlings from the nurseries and so on will be up to the users.